Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football. Perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray here on the commentary position, joined by Lee Dixon to help me describe all the action. And what we have coming up for you is live coverage of this Ligue 1 match. It is Rennes against Paris Saint-Germain. Yeah, thanks, Derek. Looking forward to a bright, lively start in this one. Quick tempo. Who can be the dominant force in the first 20 minutes? They could get the upper hand in this one. Well, here's how Rennes will line up for this match. Benjamin Bourigo plays alongside Steven Nzonzi in central midfield. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And here is the initial 11 for Paris Saint-Germain. Kaylon Navas gets the nod in goal. Thilo Kera plays alongside Presnel Kimpembe at the back. And the attacking tandem, Julian Draxler, starts alongside Edinson Cavani. Space and time for the cross. That is how to apply the pressure. Couldn't keep it. Well, they get high marks for that move, but they couldn't make it count. Understandable that we're picking out Edinson Cavani as a player to watch. What are you anticipating from the Uruguayan league? Well, when you're playing against a player, sometimes you're trying to look at what his qualities are. Is he a good hold-up player? Is he quick? Oh, a lovely ball. Will he finish? There it is. A delightful start to this match. Just what they were hoping for. Well, the pass makes the goal, Derek. Good finish, yes, but the ball through was brilliant. Slide rule pass. And underway again here with PSG in front. Kera. Dagba. Chupomoting. Cavani. Verazzi now. Bernat is with Paredes. And that shot from seemingly miles out, close. Well, he got too much space and he thought, why not? Why not shoot from here? Extremely sloppy in possession. Draxler. Danger averted. Rafinha. Space on the flank. Just drifted into the illegal position. Offside, in the opinion of the officials. The cross is on. Well, the keeper had to be watchful, getting his fingertips to it. And firing it into the area. Attending to his defensive chores. Here is Juan Bernat. Tremendous intuition to win it back. Del Castillo. Teamwork might be the key. Can they get in behind them? It was a fine-looking attack, but now they've given the ball away. Verassi now. Given away. Well, they're on the scent of something positive. Using all his defensive acumen to cut it out. Raxler now. Cavani. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Here is Juan Bernat. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Read it magnificently and intercepted. 
and they will be awarded a free kick for that not a very complicated catch for the keeper and Zonzi excellent use of the ball as they make their way forward it looks promising but he has just veered into an offside position this time and the flag has gone up here offside the decision it's with Del Castillo and one by Verratti well it looked highly promising but they got nothing out of it Paredes this could be an interesting avenue and he favours the inside route might be a chance here and meat and drink to the goalkeeper. Del Castillo. Mbe Niang. He's given it straight to the opposition. He continues to make hay. An attack full of promise. Well, that's very smart defending, and now they have the ball again. tight and you've got to try to make it a bit more difficult for your opponent than that Gay Dagba accurate pass upon accurate pass the possession lost intercepted Paredes, here is Juan Bernat. Verratti is with Paredes. Here's Rafinha. Tate. And here is Mauasa. And the attacking options appear plentiful. He must finish! Straight forward for the keeper. Well, Derek, the stats tell you everything. Slim pickings out there, not created enough. I can't see them getting back in this game unless their forwards up their game a little bit. Van that. Verratti. Oh, a nice-looking pass. Shupa Moting. The header, but far too straight to worry the keeper. Yeah, meat and drink for a goalkeeper of that class. Rafinha and the cross is very much on will he finish oh he's missed it oh goal behind Derek and he's missed it's a big miss And Zonzi. Mauasa with it. An important interception. Gay. It's with Del Castillo. Mauasa with it. Dangerous looking attack. What can he do from here? Well, they've lost possession of the ball. Edinson Cavani now. Chupomoting. Gay. Draxler. And the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. And here is Mauasa. Poor pass under no real pressure. Slipshot passing. Mbe Niang. 
And with that, the first half draws to a close. Underway in the second half, Paris Saint-Germain have the lead here. Alert defending. Nzonzi. Here's Rafinha. Moving forward effectively. Giving the ball away. It's with Paredes. Verratti now. Here is Juan Bernat. Paredes. Passes like that, very much in his repertoire. I think most fans would be pretty happy with this man's display so far. Well, Derek, you're right. He has played well and goals win games. He's been a joy to watch in this form. Sit back and enjoy him in the second half. Well, just couldn't keep the ball. Another game from Liga for you to enjoy with us live on EA TV. It's Rennes facing Strasbourg. Well, that should be a really interesting matchup atmosphere. I'm sure we're going to get an absolute belter, Derek. Paredes. Here is Juan Bernat. Well, coming up on EA TV, more action from Liga. It's Paris Saint Germain facing Toulouse. Yeah, I'm predicting a cracker there. Both teams will have a real go at each other, I'm sure. Draxler, on a smart enough cross there, but no attacker able to touch it. Cleared away. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Crucial interception amid impending danger. And possession lost, intercepted. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, the header was respectable, but the goalkeeper always seemed to have it covered. PSG are going to switch things around on the personnel front. Verratti. Gay. What a shocking pass, really. And it's with Inzonzi now. Well, they want that equaliser, but the passing remains smooth. Electing to cross into the centre. And the goalkeeper, Lee, a picture of concentration. Well, he had his eye on the ball. He waited for the striker, and then he smothered it. It's really, really good goalkeeping. So the corner played into the box. A deft clearance. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Shubham Mating has it. A chance maybe from the wide position. Thunders clear. Oh, goodness, he was right on top of the situation to get the ball back for his team. Verratti. Looked as though they might be in just for a second or two. It's with Mata. And they are on the move again. Surely! Just had to keep his concentration to the maximum, and he did. A chance for them to provide a test in the form of a corner. Punched away. Now he must favour the cross. A really disappointing effort, you've got to say. Well, he's way, way off target. A real poor effort with his head. Burigo. And it's with Inzonzi now. Here's Rafinha. And that's an important intervention.
Draxler now. Shupo Moting read it superbly to take back possession. Well, it's come down to the final 20 minutes here. Well, Derek, just listen to that noise. Doing everything they can to try and help the players out. Can they get this equaliser? A highly purposeful attack, this. The emphasis on getting the ball forward. Given away. Mata. Good numerical situation. Might be a chance here. A 1v1 situation, and the goalkeeper does his job. Really good experience there. Picked his time. Really good save. Well, chance after chance. Derek, listen to the crowd. They're expectant. Not to be this time. No foul. PSG advantage. I think he knew he was guilty of fouling. Free kick conceded. Well, that hasn't done much to enhance his team's prospects. It is a red card, and you can see what his teammates think about it. Well, you can, but they've just got to carry on with their game. It's not over. Keep doing your things you're good at. It might turn around. Goalkeeper's ball every day of the week. And it's a matter of what occurs in the final 15 minutes. Now it's with Hunu. Straight down the throat of the opposition. Dangerous looking attack. Crossing possibilities. Paredes. Cavani. Sustained pressure and now they have the ball. Burigo. And they continue to advance, and a lot of options here. Not a good pass. And breaking at pace with Menace. Cavani. Paredes. Well, at first glance, you would think a strong possibility of a red card. Let's see. Will this prove to be a turning point? A sending off. Everything was going their way. But will it continue in that fashion, Lee? Well, goals change games, Derek, but sometimes red cards do. Will this be one of them? Raxler now. Moving into the advanced position. Mbappe! Burigo. Well, it's a constant struggle for them to get out of their own half. It's with Burigo. Who knew? Here's Burigo. On the ball, Nyanyo. Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving, because it's still close. Here's Mbappe. He continues to make hay. Dagba. Others to play it to. And he failed to get it away properly. Well, on the volley, that's not how he had planned it in his mind. No, he certainly saw the ball going in a different direction than it went in. Substitution it is for PSG. Well, just listen to the crowd. They want a bit more. They know there's still time to grab an equaliser. Surely they'll get another chance or two. Rafinha. It is a decent-looking attack here. Options in the centre. Time is not on the side. This corner could help the prospects as they look for an equaliser. Played into the centre of the box. Cleared away. Here's Rafinha. Enzonzi. Well, body in the way. He's given it away. And he's beaten him here. And space for the cross.
Nyanyo. Here's Burigo. They've got to be really mindful of the time situation. Attacking, though they might. It's got to be! A tremendous save by the Costa Rican. Well, he looks at his back four. He doesn't need to. He make a save like that. You don't need a back four. Corner kick played in. That's all they can conjure for now. <laughs> it's one corner after another at the moment. And now the delivery gets his glove on it. And there goes the full-time whistle. And I think you can hear at home what the fans are thinking. Still seething following the issuing of the red card. And they're not happy about the result either. Well, they can shout all they want, but it's just indiscipline from the player. It really is a poor decision from him. Referee, not really much choice. Sending him off, red card. Frustrating day at the office. Plenty of players waiting in the middle. Well, the header was respectable, but the goalkeeper always seemed to have it covered.